when will this end? Here I am, playing this tiny monitor. I've had it! I need a solution! Huh? What's in the box? Yes! This is what I've been waiting for! Yes! 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 The 2D lifestyle, it's over! And now it's time for 3D! Thanks to LG! 3D is back again. Well, I mean, not really, but you know what I mean. And I am so happy because, you know, guys, I happen to have a fetish for gaming monitors, especially from LG. And today, Encarcamo Gaming will not be an exception because we have this 29 inch ultra wide HD gaming monitor, baby! And, uh, well, you know, this is the second one that I do a review. So let's see if this monitor will stand out all the tests from the Forger of Pain. Once you hook up this bad boys, you'll notice right from the get-go that everything looks splendid. This is by no means something unexpected from LG, but it's also worth mentioning that this is due to the fact that it has IPS with 16.7 million colors. Damn! Let's not forget it's 2560 by 1080 pixels with an aspect ratio of 21.9. Okay, that was a mouthful. In contrast with the other LG curved monitors, this is defined by the slick edges that are really thin and also the gaming stand, of course. And speaking of, the gaming stand is really, really easy to set up. You only need a screwdriver and easy PC. Definitely, you won't have any issues setting this monitor, rest assured. Once everything is ready, you can see in the back of the monitor two HDMI inputs and a headphone jack. And like I mentioned earlier, you can check out its thin borders that hug the rest of the screen. This baby is meant to be paired with a PC, but of course you can use it to work and browse the internet with your Cybernet helmet. And if you're a rebel just like this guy right here, you're gonna use your video game consoles and why not? You can do it, so just do it. But you have to take into consideration that if you wanna listen to the audio, you have to use external speakers. As I started playing my games, I noticed no input lag whatsoever. Everything felt smooth. And even if it sounds weird, organic. Why so smooth, you might ask? Let me tell you. One millisecond reduction blur. A response time of five milliseconds. And AMD FreeSync technology. There's only one small catch. The FreeSync technology only works with a computer that has a AMD video card. This feature in particular is what makes this happen, especially in fast-paced games. This baby has everything you need for gaming, you know, the works. As always, the image in these LG gaming monitors, they don't disappoint, and they keep up to their highest standards, even though it's a small package. And you know what? It's very affordable, even though it's an ultra-wide IPS. Go figure. There are even more ways to customize the image setting to your liking or your needs, depending on the game you're playing. For example, if you're watching a movie, there's the cinema mode. If you're playing first-person shooters, and the one that most surprised me is RTS, for the classic feeling, baby. If I want to be picky with this monitor and I had just one complaint, I would say that you have to use a screwdriver. I mean, it's not hard, but if you're a lazy ass like me, and I don't know, maybe the last LG monitor that I did the review on, I think that thing spoiled me. If you're looking for high quality with the most advanced features like only LG can offer, then this ultra-wide HD 29-inch monitor is for you. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Karakamo Game. Like or die.